You know, it's fine. Just drown a little bit. It's good for your health. <laughs> it isn't. It's good for your no. health. Guess who that is? I'll give you a hint. It starts with an A and it's very real. How dare you make me hear that with my own two ears? <laughs> Mike Lou and Rachel, where did they go? I'm here. <laughs> where did she go? There, hi. Hello. Ma'am. <laughs> there they are. Hello. Sometimes you just gotta crouch in your weird <laughs> corridor <laughs> and things. So anyway, oh! we're, um, we're playing There's a game a... that Mike Lou has invented. Um, called Debate Disasters, and it's kind of based off of Don't Get Me Started, which, um, we did a video with him, uh, where we played that a little while ago, and basically, um, we will have two people, and they get a topic, uh, that's basically this versus that, and then they have to choose a side and debate each other for two minutes, and then the judges decide on who they think it gets it won, and then they get points, um, and then if they tie, then they do, like, a battle to the death, and then whoever, uh, wins that gets an extra point. And it's a fun time. We played, we played an episode of it on Michael Lou's channel. What? Are we doing one <laughs> on Rachel's channel? Is that the thing that's happening? I will give you a, a link to uh, to her channel, and there will be a link on my video as well for both of their channels. Are we doing a video on hers, though? <laughs> we need an answer. We'll <laughs> just link it down there and you guys will have to figure it out for yourselves. It's a mystery. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so we're just doing more of this game because it's fun and we have this weird layer of dra dragon head. So, and you uh, have uh, created this uh, madness. Those two con t contestants will be Mikeru and Weichuru, and they will be fighting about something, and me and Glitch will be judging. It is Overwatch or TF2. Oh boy, I'm glad well, I didn't get that one because I have never played right. either of those games. I will pick TF2, and Weichuru can be Overwatch. Okay. All right. Starting Robert, in I'm three, two. Whenever you're ready. Um. Me, me? Well, I'm ready. I'm yes. Ready. Yes. You're. It's your turn. What? Um, I thought it was. One. All right. So TF2 or Team Fortress 2. I'm just gonna keep referring you to T TF2 to make it easier. And what are you doing, Glitch? Nothing. <laughs> I'm doing nothing. <laughs> um, <laughs> And I have never played TF2, already a sore argument here, and I just know TF2 from, from memes. Specifically, the Super Mario Glitchy 4 memes, and they're freaking hilarious. I personally am a fan of Heavy Vansa Sandwich, Doctor, and Doctor. I'm so and then no, and nope. you, you have to, you have to contribute eventually. Oh yeah. Uh, do I have to say objection? Yes. Okay, objection. <laughs> One second best TF2 meme is no. Nope. You're supposed to be defending your own, okay, your side. I, I said second, so I'm trying to defend. Uh, <laughs> whatever. Okay. Right. Okay. Overwatch is best because it also has its its side to its meme. I need healing! I need healing! Genji. Um, Mercy. Mm, she's the best healer. She Doc a Medic is just one of those crazy, insane people. He he's like Chara. And then Mercy actually has sanity. And, um. I think that. While it is true Overwatch has its more diverse characters, it also has the deadest crap meme. The Genji I need healing. <laughs> which, which I think TF2 has its own similar meme where uh, the scout says, need a dispenser here, need a dispenser here, need a dispenser here! Oh, 
Well, that's probably not as much as a meme. Oh, no. And they were I, that's the time. I, so I'm just glad that I didn't have that because I know jack about both of those games. I also have a cat now. He's, Kitty. Yes, he's sitting on my lap. What are you doing, Glitch? <laughs> nothing. I've changed <laughs> nothing about this. Oh my god, this is actually kind of creepy. <laughs> So, All let right. me see right. here. Uh, um, I know my vote. I'm gonna say that Leichulu wins because I like her point about diverse characters. Diversity in media is important. You uh, will die. <laughs> I don't know how. I don't know I where. I got revenge for you killing me last time. <laughs> I'm also going to vote for Leichulu just because I've got it. I've got it. Hey, no bias, God, no biased opinion. No biased opinion. I think so. You need actual some reasoning, points. not just I want to spite you. I think she made some solid points about you know the 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 the, the Overwatch memes are fresher because it's a newer game and the characters are more diverse. The graphics are a lot better. That's true. There's a you know I I I um, I, I think she's I think she's got she's a got solid some defense. Points. She's got some good points. Yeah. And I Fine. Don't fight my Great, true. Yeah. You win. Now you get to debate against. Wait, no, who went for- you cut Cakey, you get to bait against Cakey. Come here, my boy, I love you. Come here. Stop oh. running away from us! <laughs> this is my corner now. This is my corner. No. Okay. Yeah. Alright, fine, you get your corner? You so get your corner? Down. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no! <laughs> Alright. Um, I volunteer as tribute oh, to throw down too. against Wade. Alright. Rachel, it's your turn to debate against Kate. It's time to duel. It's time to duel. All right, we need a topic. Our topic is tiny whales or tiny zebras. <laughs> I'm gonna choose tiny whales. <laughs> All right, Rachel, you get zebras. I like zebras right. anyway. What was wait? What was the other topic? Tiny zebras or tiny whales? <laughs> I like zebras anyway. <laughs> All right, I'm starting the timer. Going? Three, two, one. It's time to do All right. Well, uh, tiny like whales. Here's the thing about tiny whales. They are far superior to tiny zebras for a multitude of reasons. First of all, Objection. it's funnier. Look, perhaps, sorry. Okay. It, it, it works. It works so long as you can be heard. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> anyway, um, have you ever seen Madagascar? Yeah. Marty. The circus right Afro. I'm bringing oh. back that meme. That's right. Objection. I raise you again the fact that whales are the world's largest creature. Nope. So then when you have a tiny one that you can put in an aquarium or a small fish bowl and carry around with you, it is far, far greater a gift than a tiny zebra. <coughs> tiny zebras would be cute and they would be fun and you could like get a mouse and have it ride like the zebra like, like, like a horse, but a whale would just be way better. Um, objection. Be way cuter than friends. How would you keep it in a tank? Like, whales are pretty big. Zebras, you can just keep it in your backyard. It's tiny whales or tiny zebras. Yeah, so the whales tiny would be tiny. Very how tiny, tiny are you talking? Like goldfish size, I'm thinking. So I, have I would objection. think maybe half its original size. Oh, okay. Half? Uh, then maybe, maybe. I don't know. Wait, so it's half? <laughs> Half of the original size, so it would not be goldfish size. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, well, then, yeah, you would have trouble keeping it in a cage. I mean, um, a, uh, a, a thing. <laughs> a thing. Alright, then I'll put it in an aquarium and it'll have a happy Unless... life and I will get to be friends with it and it'll be like free willy, but like with the whale that's like half no, the size of a normal it would be, whale. It would be, um. Time up! <laughs> So many dragon heads. What have you done, Glitch? I've done nothing. <laughs> nothing has changed. Dicky Moe. 
<laughs> and dragon heads don't look don't look like ordinary ender dragons. They look like a weird dragon from Twilight Princess. So who won? Do you think? Eh. Did I win? Okay. What is happening here? I win your sister. <laughs> Yeah, what have you done? You, <laughs> you are no. making the dragon angry! Uh oh. Nothing has changed, I've done nothing. <laughs> These lies! These are lies that I am fixed with Alright. Honestly, if you if there were tiny zebras, you'd be able to have basically a zebra pony. It'd be like a, an, a dog size, like my dog size, my husky size. So, right, you point. get point. Now, Glitch, what is your opinion on this subject? And stop messing with the dragon! <laughs> I've, I don't know if I I've right. done nothing. And You're I, lying! I personally I don't know if I think that right. Kiki had some good points, so it is a tie. Yes. Alright, it's a tie. Everyone go into the death pit. <laughs> and so we must fight to the death. To determine Casual battle to the death. The victor. Must you must get an axe before you go into the death pit, or a, a, or sword, whatever you pick. But it's been established that the people who pick sword are at a severe disadvantage. Actually, the axe and the sword do a difference of two, and the sword is faster. All right, wait. I just picked the axe because I can kill you and do it. <laughs> really? Do we have to fight? Yes, you do. I mean, you could forfeit your victory to me. I'll accept that. <laughs> you didn't get a sword. I don't I think I have one in my inventory. Oh, okay. Ah! You not you you not in survival vision off. mode. <laughs> my night vision is off. Oh, hold on. I come in with the save. She left. <laughs> Do I win by default? Wait, what? She oh, where did she go? She's up there. Jump down. Fight to this. Survival mode. This is a beautiful high class bout. Trying to do cuphead and it's not working well. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm just standing here. Still not in survival mode. I feel like this is- I feel like I'm at a disadvantage here. <laughs> there! What the heck? Anyway... <laughs> so, I get an extra Someone point, so I'm not losing by that much. <laughs> I'm drawing, guys. I, I got it. You know, it's fine. Just drown a little bit. It's good for your health. <laughs> it isn't. It's good for you now. Shall I spread the TF2? The what? Or should I spread the eggy? Oh no. I'm concerned either way. I'm gonna be real. Alright. Like so, who, okay, so Glitch versus Cakey, I'm guessing. Dun 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 dun. Alright, on the topic. Um, you have to take it out of the machine, too. I was really otherwise... hoping it was gonna be the Death Note one that I will. Cause I'm you're the only person who I'm confident knows enough about Death Note to have a debate. But it would be a struggle. So it's Umbreon versus Espeon. And I'm gonna snag Umbreon from you, cause... I don't know crap about Espeon. Umbreon, <laughs> Dark Types, Bay. Dark, dark Type is Bay. I can do Espeon. I don't know what type they are, but I can do it. Uh, Umbreon is dark type, and Espeon is physic. Psychic. It's not physic, it's psychic. Close enough. Psychic uh, is basically light, so who cares? Listen, I, I listen. Know, like, you all need some TF2 and Overwatch in your life. I love Overwatch. <laughs> get it. Get, get, get. Go get it in the death pit. <laughs> all right. So, Michael, are you gonna set a timer or should I? I I'm I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm just busy spend, spreading the TF2. The Taft. It's set, it's been set. I'm, I don't know what you're waiting for. Oh, okay. Oh, so. well, you hit it. Hold us. Umbreon is clearly the superior because 
they're so cute, and they're like emo aesthetic. I don't know how you can beat that. I don't know how you beat emo aesthetic Eevee evolution. Because Eevees are already great Pokemon. And then you add the fact that there are so many evolutions, and then you add the fact that clearly Umbreon is the superior because they got cool powers, dark type for the win. And then, as I said before, very emo. I, I dig the aesthetic. Super cute, looks like a cat with big ears. I'm here for it. Wow. <laughs> so, Espeon also looks like a cat, uh -huh. in a way. Uh, and they're also Did a you very both look it up? purple color, which is always good. That, like, pastel cool colors aesthetic is strong. Uh, and they are a psychic type. They have psychic powers, and honestly, like, what, what's cooler than psychic abilities? Um, objection. What's cooler than psychic abilities? Dark, dark abilities. Dark abilities. Dark abilities. <laughs> dark abilities. <laughs> you know, they can do all the spooky stuff. Let me tell you, I've, I've been playing some Pokemon games recently, and dark type moves, ghost type moves, those are some, pa they're powerful. It's some, some class A destruction type crap, alright? It's the only good move my Chansey has is a dark type move. <laughs> Literally the only one. It's the only thing that keeps it from being useless. So obviously... Okay, the pointlessness of you Chansey has to do with the fact that Espeons are clearly better than Umbreons. Because Espeons are just so cool looking, and they're so cute. Okay. That's it. That's it. Break it up. Alright. So, Rachel, what do you think about this? Who's better? Me. Based on these important details. It's me. I go with you. the power, the um power po type of power Pokemon and stuff. So I would go whoever was um um like I tend to choose the Pokemon that are most powerful. And Umbreon can be pretty much a pain in the butt if like you set him up correctly. And I don't know if Espeon can learn the Fairy type move. I don't know. I never stop really placing Dragon Heads. Have an Espeon. As much I like, um, I prefer Umbreon due to his um his design and stuff. So I guess Umbreon. Yeah. I will also choose Umbreon because most evolutions are fast, which means high crit rates and always goes first. And yeah, and Umbreon is a dark type. Me being Dark Link, I am have an affinity for dark, so. Uh, they sound like kind of go. Wait, who is like... Umbreon? I I object. It sounded like you two just picked pick the Pokemon you liked. Well, I I, I, do I had to add to this. <laughs> well, I do like Umbreon. I also do like Pokemon that are pretty powerful. Yeah, well, see, I, I added the speed thing. Stars. Have you ever tried? He have said you ever... that he preferred Umbreon because of how it looked, and I mentioned that it looks really cool. And then she said that she preferred Umbreon because it's powerful, and I mentioned the dark and ghost both, type actually. moves are very powerful. So really, dark types don't use ghost type moves. Well, um... that's some tough crap because I don't really care that much. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I got, I got disconnected. I don't know what happened. Oh, jeez. You back now, though. I... Have you ever tried to fight a Jolteon? Have you ever tried to fight a freaking Jolteon? <laughs> yeah, they, they are were, fast. So is Flareon. Jolteon is the fastest evolution. I think just evolutions in general are fast. And adding dark just makes it more appealing. So Hot take. I like just Eevee. Just, just the way they all have. Rachel, Ray give, give, give the slime a point. Mmm, toasty. Uh, <laughs> give the slime a point because <laughs> Keiki was the one that chose Umbreon. Wow, that was a blatant favoritism. <laughs> hey, they explained their points and both were points oh, that I talked about. So... Yes! <laughs> Give the slime, the tasty slime a point. 
FYI. <laughs> it's delicious. So, so. My, point, my latest point is a bit a bit special, but I, I enjoy it all the same. I don't know, it's so I lazy. win again, so who's gonna face the waiting champion? Alright, so... Uh, it would be me, actually. I was the last person. And... Well, L versus Light. Dang it, we could have gotten that last round! <laughs> Do you know what? Death Note? <laughs> I don't even know what this is. I take that as a no. We couldn't have gotten that last round where we both would have known what we were talking about. Just you really think you I have no idea what, what this is. Better than an L. <laughs> You're right. I just wanted to face you so I could take an L and then like you just have to flounder. Because L... It's unrelated to the debate. Is Absolutely. it Death Note? I've never Death watched a single episode of Death Note, by the way. I think I do know who Light is due to um that um one episode. Film I Theory. Think. Yeah, game I know. I know what it is through Film Theory. Same here. L is clearly the superior character. He's the best character in all. Of I forfeit. I forfeit. I know nothing. Next, nothing about this. I could talk about it for. Done. <laughs> we could pick a new one if you want. Oh, I could just. I want to pick a freaking new one. <laughs> okay, this is much better. Something that we all know everything about. Chara versus Azriel. Oh, I feel like I have to pick Chara just because that's who I voice act. <laughs> I have to pick Azriel because you chose Chara and rude. <laughs> that's how it works. <laughs> all right. And one. him. Oh, because a certain someone is in that voice. Hey, what the heck? <laughs> what are you doing, Glitch? Should I do the Alright, one, two, three, yes. go. Alright, we're doing it. <laughs> Give me a drink of water because my throat's already going down the drain. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. All right, Asriel. Let's let's plan it out. Asriel has a chance that nobody in on the freaking earth has ever had. A chance at a second life while reliving a life that is not his own. Flowey. Now, after living that, Asriel pretty much after getting his his <laughs> emotions back is now a murderous psychopath with the ability to feel and actually question his life choices. Objection. Chara's always a murderous psychopath, so I feel like that's a mute point. <laughs> that's all I this, have to say. That is not true. Chara, okay. This is why I would better Chara because you're just wrong on Chara. You're right. It's, uh, the thing about Chara, actually, I'm going to keep going. Chara is a very complex and interesting character because despite the fact that in our role plays, I kind of... um water them down into this one kind of psychopathic, over-the-top, energetic person. They're actually very complex, and there's a lot of discourse in the fandom over whether they're good or evil, or whether they're just somebody who has lost their soul, and that's the way they are, or if their um, actions that Azriel talked about from before they died are, you know, accurate to who they are, and that they were always just a psychopath. There's a lot of, there's a lot of you know ambiguity around the character and that makes it extremely interesting and it's just a level of depth that Azriel does not have. How are they saying Azriel has a crap ton of death. One, have you ever noticed how Azriel in his final form yes, I'm pulling that meme in his final form he <laughs> looks and seems frick! <laughs> Crap, I need my- I need my milk, so I can show everybody my beautifulness. What I was gonna say is that Azrael in his final- looks like the Delta Room. The thing that says that it's an angel of death, or an angel that will free them from the underground. Guess who that is? I'll give you a hint. It starts with an A, and it's very real. How dare you make me hear that with my own two ears? <laughs> <laughs> also, you're wrong about Char. Char's not a murderer if you actually the game. And ignore the jump scare. Okay, but like they did, they did steal, steal Flisk's soul and wanted to wipe out humanity. Want... It's kind of like a yeah, weird no. thing. <laughs> I feel. All right. 
I want to, okay. All right. I want to go on a side tangent. A little, a little side tangent real quick. Real quick. After, after points are awarded, which side would you choose? Rachel. Hey, you should choose Chala. Come on. Uh, Look into my soul. <laughs> Uh, just, just, yeah, this is terrifying. Glitch, what the frick have you- <laughs> Yeah, this is terrifying, I'm out of here. Cuba, you really <laughs> destroyed this place, haven't you? All of my hard work to empty this place of water. Gone to ruin because of you, Glitch. It's gone to ruin! <laughs> just for me to fill it with this. So, I, I want to know if I get to increase my margin of victory or not. Uh, Rancho, you have to give someone a point, either me or or Keiki, about who is more right about their point. I have a feeling that, that uh, Chara or Asriel is supposed to be, like, who would win in a fight. Uh, no. Uh, well, we just started talking about, about, like, the that. philosophy to find <laughs> both of the characters. I was, just tr I was gonna originally do Frisk or Chara. But I, but I couldn't choose that, so I kind of did Azrael and Char because. Yep. I really so, like Azrael. So, he's a cutie pie. All right. And, all right. Is Glitch. Frankly, yeah, you're right. Glitch. Yeah. Will you stop wrecking my home? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stop putting dragon heads everywhere, though. Yeah, you know what? I'm out. I'm. I'm done with this. I'm done with you and your bullcrap. <laughs> I want to know who won. Did I, I win? I gave you a point. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, Rachel, who do you, who do you think won? Though. You. All right. Into the death pit. <laughs> oh, man. All right. I don't even care that much because even though you're probably going to defeat me, I'm still winning. Is there a parrot down here? No. Oh, yeah. I spawned a bunch of parrots and murdered them. How dare you? Parrots are <laughs> so cute. I did- I did that just because I wanted to piss you off. S is not a valid number. S is not a valid number. S is not a valid number. Shut up. S is a valid number if you believe hard enough. Come on, Mackerel. Let's go down. I've been in here for like oh, ages! <laughs> I've been here for ages! I'm killing the parate! my world! I oh. killed the parate. Okay, so. You won. I am still victorious. I get. I get a point. Will you stop yeah, with the parrots? They're annoying. The oh crap. I will murder them. All of them. Every one of them. Put one on my shoulder. Yep, you can do that. That's a thing really? you can do. Really? What? Yeah, that's a thing you can do. How do you do that? How do you do that? I want to. You have to tame them, and then once you tame them, you <laughs> How dare you, Glitch? How do you know that was me? It wasn't me. You're gonna tame them with fire. <laughs> it told me Glitch killed Micro 3. Oh, it tells you. The train was crackers. All right. I'm done with this. You know what? TNT. That's it. I am out of here. No, no. no. I'll do it! I'll do it! Don't make it! Oh, so, I'm gonna say that- I'll do it! Don't make me! I wanna claim my victory and also because there's not much room left for me to get any more points. I'm just All right. saying. Okay. One more! I won! So, fight me! <laughs> fight me! Uh, no, it looks like Cakey won. Uh, wait, true came in at a- Fairly close second. Glitch clocking it out of solid zero. You cannot <laughs> stop. My, my goo, why? My it's too late! <laughs> you ruined my home! My point! I think you ruined it a little bit. Not until you did. My points. My points are all gone. Congratulations, Glitch, for making it to the Stone Age. Now burn in the everlasting fire that I'm about to. This is the 
This is taking a pretty up. I escaped it. I don't want to blow up. Um, if you guys like this commentary, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, click the notification bell and check out our merch if you want to. And, you know, make sure to join Nerdhood because it's a dysfunctional place. And that's pretty much it. Good, good. Goodbye. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I promise I won't murder everyone if you don't check.